Hey guys, Fumbly here today, and welcome back to Zoo Tycoon 2. So let's go ahead and start another freeform game, because we, we did one before, but you know, <laughs> that kind of went wrong in the end. Let's go to good old sunny Australia. Uh, so that's grassland, what was the other one? Temperate forest. Now let's go to the grassland one. Is that, so is this the exact same map as before? Is this going to be the exact same map as before, or is this... I don't understand how this works. I don't think... Okay, so I don't think it really matters where it is on the map, but, uh... Alright, let's go Grassland. Is there just, like, a... Grassland Crater? Oh, okay. Well, is it Grassland... There's Grassland Lodge. Is it... Can I just tell it to be flat? I guess it doesn't matter. Alright, let's go Grassland Lodge. Let's build us a zoo. So, uh, in between episodes, I did the tutorials on how to do, sort of, marine animal shows. And sort of how to train animals and all that kind of cool stuff. So, I know a little bit more. How about that? Uh, let's close my zoo. Don't need to be open right now. So let's see what we're working. Oh, this is much better. It's all kind of like flat and we... Oh, this is massive too. All right, so th I think this is going to be a little bit easier to work with than the, the previous one. Right, so what I want to do... I think, first of all, let's first of all just get a little guest area up and running. Or maybe a staff area. We'll, we'll kind of get the boring stuff out of the way first. So let's see. Let's just go... Let's uh, filter by... Uh, Default theme, because I know I don't want anything fancy. So let's get some food stalls and all that kind of cool stuff. So let's go like that. Uh, let's get a hot dog. So let's get uh, what are, what other foods do we have? Not much really. Uh, coffee drink stands and water drink stands and soda drink stands. This is gonna be the main eatery area. That's my the sub food stand. I like how- why do they have to have food? I, I guess it's so it's clear that one's food or drink, but it really shouldn't be in the title. There should be a better way to name stuff. And a toilet! Alright, that fills up the area quite nicely. Look at that. Uh, let's get some... But, uh, is there no... I can't just do like a picnic table kind of deal? Uh, let me go all. Oh, no, there we go. Okay, cool. Yeah, this is what I'm after. I thought there were picnic tables. Uh, can we, um... Hang on, let me... I want to put some of these... Let's put these all diagonally. This would be beautiful. Oh, this would be so good. Yes. This is going to be the best zoo ever, guys. I kind of know what I'm doing now. I say kind of very loosely. Uh, so let's go diagonal and then like that. Oh, yeah, this is going to be so good. I wonder if they can get to one that's there. I don't know. We're going to put them there. Don't know if they can use all of these, but we'll find out later. Okay, let's get some bins, some trash cans, as the game calls them. Uh... Let's put them, I don't know where I want to put these, one there, let's go one over there, oh, this is such a good zoo, dude. Do you, bro, do you even zoo? Do, oh! No, I put the bin in the wrong, this is going to be great, oh, no! Alright, so, let's <laughs> me move these, I guess I probably don't need that many bins. Yes, do, do you really need a confirmation for selling a bin? A confirmation win, okay, so this is our, our main kind of entrance, now let's get in uh, the staff center area. So, here we go. Let's get a little staff center over here. Uh, we'll put this, uh... Put it around here, because there's not a lot of room here for anything else. Uh, it's not really big enough for an exhibit or anything, so... We'll just chuck in a staff center. You have to remove that tree, because that's right in the way. Yes! I don't need to confirm selling a tree. Okay, so let's get, uh, staff center. Dirt path. No. Get a nice, uh, path under here for the staff. Okay, and then I'm gonna... Do... Uh, no, that doesn't look good. That does not look good. I'm trying to make it a nice sort of looking path somewhere. For the staff. Because we're going to put a, we'll have to put a gate across it somewhere. Um, maybe if we do that. Oh, that's, that's completely unnecessary, but let's do it! Okay, so let's go hedge fence. Uh, we're going to go from... Uh, Okay, like, can that curve? Oh, I don't. I want to curve that. I like the curve like that. Okay. Well, let's do that. And then it's gonna go around here, and it's gonna go all over here. Oh, this, this. I don't understand how the curves work in this game, though. Like sometimes it curves, sometimes it just goes diagonal, and look, now it's curving again. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> what is going on with that corner? Oh, this is this is this is not going well. Okay, maybe this zoo is not the best zoo ever. It's a pretty good zoo. Maybe not the best one, though. Alright, plan B. We're gonna go like this. I'm just gonna go around there. 
up around the back. What does what does sort of encompass that little area there? Okay, cool. Then we're gonna put the gate there. And that goes into the staff area. Beautiful. That's good. Wish that had a curve on it though. I don't know why. Like I don't, I don't understand. Like why is this one not curved and the other ones are? No curve. Why wouldn't you curve? Why does that curve? Maybe we'll do that instead then. Just because it curves and the other one doesn't. I don't understand. I have to put something there. Uh, let's put in. Uh, not an educator podium. Like a little store kind of thing. I don't know. What do we have? We have like loads of things to put in. Marine gift cart, Shetland pony ride. Oh, we could we could totally do a Shetland pony ride. I think we should do one. <laughs> Maybe not there. Um. So we already had coffee and all that, didn't we? Cheesecake cart. Oh. Fruit cup cart. What else we got? Cheesecake. Cotton candy cart. This can be the cart land. I think that's what we're gonna we're gonna do it. Cheesecake cart. There you go. Let's get a oh pretzel cart. Yes. All right, and then we're gonna go. Oh, we'll just put this pathway under it too. A little cart area there, selling a few things. Uh, then we'll do a few benches. Oh, this, we're not even at the animal part of this yet. It's already incredible. Um, <laughs> why can't I put these on the edge of the pathway? Like they're like in the middle of the path. I want to put them on the edge. Oh, let's we'll just put beans. There we go. Plenty of places to dump your trash. Okay. So entrance of the zoo is better than ever. Uh, it's looking way better than it could ever do. So I want to do, I guess, uh, a tank exhibit. Now, I don't know if I want to... I think we'll try and sink it into the ground as much as we can. So let's go acrylic tank wall. Or it's marine-themed tank wall. Uh, let's just go to the def de uh, default one. So we'll have the main animal tank. Uh, so wait, where, where do I want to do the show, I guess, is the question. Uh, maybe I'll do it over this side because there's no little, oh, there's a little pond thing there. Okay, so we'll, we'll do the, the main sort of tank here. Okay, yeah, then we've got square mode now. So we're going to go, well, that doesn't make any sense. It's like connecting to the wall there. It looks stupid. Anyway, so let's, let's say we got that area there. <laughs> it's annoying because it, uh, yeah, okay, that doesn't work. Um, all right, let's try that again. Uh, let's just keep it one away from the wall this time. So let's put it there. Okay, so what we want to do is, you know, we want to lower tank wall. Because I ideally want to have this at the level of the ground. And then we'll put like a little stand in front of it. So I think that'll be good. And we're going to lower tank floor. Yeah, so that still gives them all the height. Uh, so this is just sort of where the animals live. I, I guess we could have a little exhibit area for it. I don't see why not. Well, let's figure out where the show tank goes. Opaque. Green. Why would I want an opaque one? I want to... Nice clean tank wall. Uh, so if we put this, let's say we go, that'll be my show tank. All right. Uh, so I, I can actually raise the water on this one. Do I want to though? I don't know. Oh, actually no, maybe what we'll do, keep this one low, but raise this one up. Uh, so then, like, people can see in the side of this one. Yeah, that makes more sense. Because this is, like, sort of the exhibit tank anyways. So, yeah, we'll we'll, we'll figure this out. Alright, so I need to do uh, tank portal. That's a little too high, though, isn't it? Uh, well, how come they're level? Like, the ground is there. Why can't the wall be lower down? Oh, yeah, there it goes. I don't know why the wall dropped down like that, though. Um... Oh, there we go. What does this do? Raise tank wall. Yeah, there we go. Uh, lower tank wall. Okay, cool. Yeah, there we go. The, the portal works now. It's in there so the animals can swim into the show tank. Here we go. This is going to be good. Um, that's probably a massive tank, but uh, we'll have a few animals in there. So, let, well, let's figure out what we're going to do first. So, let's go... Let's so filter by marine animals first, I think. Uh, marine mania. Here we go. So dolphins are obviously going to be the easiest to train. So let's let's go with these guys. Uh, they're after a coastal biome. So let's go ahead and get that. Uh, reef, uh, wetlands, alpine. I guess. It, oh yeah, it's alphabetical. So if we just yeah, they just tap in there. It does it for us. Is there? Do any of these change anything? Ah. Okay. So it just that just does its bit. Oh, actually, if we uncheck those. Does it add any of that stuff in? Oh, there we go. Get some rocks in there. Hell yeah, they love rocks. 
I'm, I'm trying to get the, the best balance of rock. There we go. Um, what's this? That's not as big as a... It, it says giant in the name. It's not as big as it appears to be. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, this will be good. Get all this stuff in here. Something is blocking kelp. What is this? Yeah, let's make this beautiful for the dolphins. I love it. Okay, so what I want to do... So, the, the, well, guests need to be able to view the dolphins when they're not in there, in the show tank. So I guess that should be fine around this area if we just do this sort of path around here. They can view it through here. It's not ideal, uh, but that's just the way it is. You know, that's the way the world works, so deal with it. Uh, a little shelter or something? I don't know. They don't really need shelter, but we'll, we'll give them a few of these things, I guess. There you go. Uh, a little bit of food. So, food box with squid. So do I actually need to put, like... Food? Is this like how they regularly get fed? Food box with fish. I don't know how this works. Uh, oh, substrate pile. There we go. Plenty of food around the place. Well, we'll make sure they have enough. You know, I want them to have enough food. That's expensive. A thousand dollars. Why is that so expensive? Uh, all right. So then they can have they can have a ball on the water. Play around with that. Get some cod. Uh, block of ice with clam. No, let's not do that. Let's do a little clam in there. Oh, this is even before the animals are in there. Okay, and then what we need to do, which I haven't actually gotten around to doing yet, was putting a, uh, tank pump in, or whatever it is, uh, which you get from somewhere. I found it last time. Anyways, tank entrance, we'll do the, uh, uh, well, we need a tank entrance on the show tank as well. Maybe we'll do... We'll do the entrance down the back here, I think. So we'll have one there, and then the other one will be right there. So the staff just go there to get into both. We'll build a pathway in a minute, of course. Uh, let's see, let's see. So what else? We need the tank pump, which I find somewhere. You'd think it'd be in here, but it doesn't appear to be. Oh. Now it's going marine mania. Um... Where could it be? I know I found it once before, because I did it in the previous zoo, right? So it's in here somewhere. Uh, unless, it's in one of the, unless we can find it in one of these categories for us, that'd be nice. Don't think so. Okay. So I guess it must have been building... Is it one of these? No, it wouldn't be one of these. Hmm. Show tank objects. Oh, water filter. Here we go. Alright, so let's, we'll put it next to this... Ladder, and we'll put one next to that ladder, so that will filter the tanks, keep them nice and clean. All right, so let's go. Upgraded large grandstand. Ah, it's not that. It's not as big as I would think. Medium grandstand. Well, this is where our grandstands are going to be for our shows. So, so that's the front. So let's go. Like, well, I don't really want a roof on it though, do I? Now, do I want the? Yeah, I want the person doing the show to stand back here, don't I? Uh, non-show objects in the tank may be sold as a real... Yeah, sure, whatever. There we go. Now it's a show tank. Beautiful. Uh, and then we want to get... Let's just use the regular grandstand, because I think they look better. So we'll totally put a whole bunch of them along here. So we're two away from the edge. So this will be our show area. Damn, this is looking good! Uh, I haven't even got around to doing any, anything else. Marine path. Hell yeah, let's get a marine path in here. A marine path under there. No, let's not do that. There you go. Uh, and then I guess I might as well do a marine path around here as well. Up to about there. Uh, I don't. I don't understand this pathway. It's so. It's so weird the way it works. Okay, let's just do that. Like, why is this not... And then when I do that, it becomes curved. What what dictates a curve and what doesn't dictate a curve? Like, why isn't that curved? Oh, there we go. That's all right. We'll do something like that. Just have a nice little thing there. Uh, let's go... Well, let's make this a little bit bigger there. There's a bit more space to walk around. Good, good. Uh, nice. Let's get a... Uh, maybe some people don't like to be in the sun, so... I have a few things there on that side. All right, so we want to go. Let's get let's get a zoom map. That makes sense. Uh, let's put one right by the entrance. So you, you come in, and bam, right in your face, right there. 
And we'll put one over here by the uh, by the dolphins, in case you get lost. Uh, we need a donation box as well, that's what we need. Which looks something like this. Yeah, I'm gonna get one of these. Okay, and then we need an educator podium. We still haven't actually got any animals, or anyone in the zoo. Um, <laughs> so, I guess we'll just put the educator podium there, or something. Alright, so what we need to do is, let's, oh! Button. This is uh this is gonna be great. This is gonna be good. You gotta bear with me here, people. Uh we need to what am I doing? Pathway. Need to get a pathway for this. This is all just gonna be staff area back here, I think, is what we're gonna do. So we'll, we'll connect the tank as well. Okay. And then this will come around. And join up there. Alright, so let's just go a little fence. Let's go just, you know, boring, boring little fence. Little chain link. Uh, I don't think I need to do a fence all the way around. I think it's sort of like people won't walk here anyways, but you know, I like to be safe. I have a fence all the way around. We'll, I'll fill that wind pathway in a second. Get a little gate there. It's going to be a staff area. Oh, look at this. It's beautiful. I'll go. Oh, no, that will go there. Just fill in that area. Oh, I didn't tell you to do that. There we go. Now it's all nice and curved for some reason. Okay, so that's our little staff area over that way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, we need some trees. So is there a nice big tree we can put in? There is a nice big tree. It's a little too big though. That's a little too ugly. Oh, that's quite nice. Nice little generic kind of tree thing. A few of these around the place. That looks good. Okay, all right, so let's let's okay, let's actually get started and open up a zoo. It's been long enough So let's get let's get everyone we need first. Let's get a maintenance worker. Probably just one for now. It'll be fine Let's get a zookeeper. Let's get an educator And we need a trainer as well because we will need to train the animals uh, So that's everyone we need then let's go ahead and get the actual animals. Oh, we have them here uh, So this is a female let's Get a female and a male and then what we need to do is close that. Go back to my animals. Uh, now, where do I find training stuff again? Or is it just here? Uh, training area. Okay, so let's put one there. Oh yeah, how do I how do I do the show stuff again? All right, here we go. Oh, well, okay. Well, we can't really do a show until um, <laughs> until we actually. Uh, if you want to, yes, discard that show. We need well, we need to set up training sort of regimes. Now, how do I do this again? So, I think I click on the animal. Let me click on train animal. Uh, no, 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 no. I go. Wait, where's my trainer? Uh, are you my trainer? Who are you? Trainer. Okay, yeah, you. Training assignments. All right, here we go. So, training assignments. Get a new one, and then I think I click on an animal. Bold no, no, where's number one? Number one. Ah, here we go. So they'll just train them in everything uh, at the moment. Yeah, that's fine. And then plus number two. But we can also train them ourselves as well, if I so wish. So I think if I want to train them myself, I click on, wait, where's number one? Training them, it's really weird. It's like a weird little mini -gun. Let's train animal. Okay, let's train them in, well, where's just a regular jump? Jump in trick area. This is the weirdest thing ever. Okay, wait, do I start? When do I start? Uh, oh, you have to swim over. Okay. Click tracer to start training bottlenose dolphin. So what you got to do is keep your mouse on this little circle thing. Click when you need to click and follow it like this. <laughs> That's the most ridiculous thing. 100%. Obviously, it gets harder the more you do it. Um, oh, obviously, in case you hadn't guessed. Yep. So he's pretty good. Uh... I reward you because I don't actually get trained until you reward them. So he's got one and a half circles out of five. That's pretty good. Let's do that again. Uh, oh, I've got to press up and I didn't have to do this in the tutorial. Up on my keyboard and down on the keyboard there. Okay, so this gets more difficult. All right. Two, one. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I'm really bad at this. Okay, yep, yeah, that was. Te oh, <laughs> I completely. Le oh, that, wow, I got distracted in that one. That did not go well. Still 77%. The game really does not punish you. That's nice. Um, there we go. Oh, not even two circles. Should we try that one again? Let's try that again and not be- oh, go away. Uh, let's try- try that again. Let's not be so inept this time. So, up, then down. <laughs> okay. 
Three, two, one. Up. Uh, down. Oh! Hey, there you go, 100 percent God, I'm good at this. This is a great game. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, and reward. Oh, look at that! We almost max out that, that skill. Or that trick. Let's do it. Let's let's just max this one out before we continue. <laughs> oh, this is thinner now. Look at this. That's how they make it harder. They make it thinner. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, whoa. <laughs> what? <laughs> so fast. Okay, did not expect it to be that fast. Alright, let's try that again. Yeah, yeah, I know it was failed. He's angry. Oh, dear. Let's try it again. I'm sorry, that was my bad. Did not expect it to go... Like, the difficulty jump just went through the roof. Okay. 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 Oh, look at that. 99%! That's good enough for me. As long as that gets us to five circle things. Uh, let's see. Here he comes. Here he comes. Or she. I can't remember. I think we bought a female first. Uh, it's close enough. The, the trainer can do the rest. <laughs> Oh, this is the most ridiculous thing ever. Alright, so now he can do vertical jump in tree. Well, let's try some of the other stuff. Hoop jump. What do we got? Bar jump. Slide on beaching platform. Swipe ball. Swipe tether ball. Oh, well, let's just start off over here. Let's, let's just do this one and see what we got to do. So, I guess it's just a different curve. Alright. Seems, seems legit. Alright. Two. One. Oh, nice and easy to start. Can you get out of the way? What are you doing? You're in the way! Stupid dolphin. Hey, there it goes. Fantastic. I'm such a good trainer. I reckon I could train dolphins in real life with all this. With all this knowledge. So, I got one and a half things. Alright, can I can I get out of this now? I'm, I'm, I'm done training. I want to go back to actually the tycoon part of the game. So, the trainer will take care of the rest. <laughs> That's the... Uh, we assigned the trainer to do it, as, at least as far as I'm aware. Uh, so... Well, we, we have animals in the zoo, so let's just go ahead and open our zoo. Uh, let's just make it free, because we're in sandbox, so... Whatever. Alright, so... That should be fine. We've got our educator. Uh, we've got a show platform. Is that like a staff member there? You're just doing nothing? You're just waiting for a show? <laughs> well, we're not going to have one for a while. We've got to wait for them to be trained. Oh, look, here they go. They're being trained now. Is that what's happening? Yeah, beaching platform. Good job. I don't know how long it takes them to do it, but... Guess I'll find out. Um, oh, people come in the zoo soon. So let's... Okay, so we've got, we got marine animals. I guess we could add another tank. We'll probably add another tank or something later on. Uh, maybe around the back here. Might have to adjust some of this. Just so we can get another animal. Because I think... Well, you can train orcas. That's for sure. I'm not sure what other animals you can train. It didn't really tell you in the tutorial. But... Uh, Alright, well, let's, let's get something dangerous. I don't want to get dinosaurs just because that's unrealistic. It's just lame. Let's get something fun. Uh... Cave lion. Oh, black leopard. That sounds fun. It just seems cool. Tropical rainforest. Um, well, how much space do you want? Low risk. Oh, low risk. That's boring. Um, <laughs> what's this one? What does that mean? Extinct is his status. Well, not in this game. What's that one? Vulnerable. Extinct. What's this? Critical. Oh. So is that just their sort of endangered? Yeah, that's just their... I thought it was like how dangerous they were. Endangered. Well, it's not. It's just their sort of numbers. What is that? Giant ground sloth. That was actually a thing? Huh. There you go. Uh, <laughs> you learn something new every day. No, I want something fun. Rhinoceros. Okay, okay. Let's just get a black rhino. Just a, just a regular black rhino. Critical. Savannah. Okay, seems easy enough. All right, so what kind of fence do you like? Well, let's just get you... Let's get the same fence we get everyone. Uh, we've got some guests in the zoo now. Looking pretty good. Uh, let's go acrylic glass fence. I think that's probably the one we're after. Uh, or is there a more fun fence? Wooden slat wind... Or oh, wooden, I don't think is a good idea. Tundra window fence. Well, it's not tundra. Is it a nice themed sort of fence I can do for the rhinos? Like a savannah fence? You do electric fence, but I don't think it's really necessary. Uh, brick window. Hmm. 
All right, well, let's just do the, do the acrylic one. Okay, so we're going to put the rhinos... Let me put them here in the middle. They should be big enough, right? <laughs> he says before the, the rhinos break free and kill everybody. Uh... I think no, we'll just put them here. They'll be they'll be right at the front. So these are like the the first thing you see when you come into the zoo. Be really cool, really awesome. So the rhinos will go all the way up here. I think should be big enough for their enclosure. Let's do that. Uh, they can have. I was gonna say they can have some of this water, but I don't know if I want to give them that. I think I'll just change the terraforming around here. So let's just connect that to that that fence there. And we'll do the same over here. Uh, that's going to go there. Under there. I presume they can't break down the exterior fence of the zoo. Not really sure how it works. Uh, but I also want to change probably this fence here because... Will this just replace it or how does this work? Oh yeah, it does. Because that's just the back of the exhibit so you can't really see out of that. Anyways. Alright, so they, they wanted Savannah, right? Uh, can I just click on that? Oh, that would have been useful if I could just click on that to get it. Uh... So I want to go to S. So now that I know it's actually alphabetical, makes it a little bit quicker. Uh, well, actually, let me let me level the ground first. Uh, flatten. Uh, no, no, no. Flat to this level. Can I get rid of the water? I thought you could. Maybe you have to do this. Oh, yeah, there we go. That gets rid of it. Easy enough. All right, yeah, then we'll, we'll add our own water in. Uh, oh, I should probably add trees as well. For them. There you go, go around here, make it look pretty good. That's some fancy, get rid of those crappy trees. No, I said get rid of that tree. Dude! Why is it not getting rid of that tree? I don't want that tree there. Alright, that was pretty good. Uh, let's give him a little bit of water, of course. Uh, we'll run it on the back. Um, like that. And a little bit of that, and a little bit more of this. Okay, uh, that's that done. Yeah, excellent commentary there. Uh, let's give him a, let's give him this. That's a little bit more natural than a like a shed looking thing. Okay, so then they're gonna want some food. Uh, let's just get some a water trowel thing over here. No, we don't want to hide them away. If they're if they're feeding, you want them near the in the front of the exhibit. So we'll do one there, and we'll do. There's, uh, this one here. What is the difference with all these? With branches, with grass. Uh, substrate pile with apples. Sure. With bananas. Look at all that food everywhere. I have so much food in here. I have a little scratching post. There you go. Dinosaur prey dummy. Oh, that's massive. Tar pit. Uh, you can do a dinosaur prey dummy. Go over here. <laughs> Oh, I don't think it can fit in there. That's depressing. Why don't a dinosaur prey mummy? Dummy, not mummy. <laughs> Why did I say mummy? Um, it doesn't fit. Uh, screw that. Squeak toy. <laughs> and a ball. Enjoy. Alright, uh, so they got a shelter, they got the trees, they got all that kind of stuff. Cool. Alright, so we need to put in a gate. Because farm was as far as I'm aware, I didn't put in a gate. So put one right there by the entrance. It's a nice thin, thin gate to walk in. Um, and let's go male rhino and one female rhino. There you go. Let's get a secondary zookeeper. I'm going to assign you. Uh, I presume I can assign you. I don't know how. Um, current duty. Uh, new assignment. I look at it like it discovers that that's a place. There you go. Assignment one. That's what you can do. Uh, okay. So, okay. Yep. Alright, let's get all the uh, the other little bits and pieces that we need. So let's get Educator Podium over here. Uh, let's get a donation box somewhere too. I mean, we don't really need donation boxes because this is a uh, sandbox, but, you know, we'll put them in anyways. For the sake of the game, because I know the game will like me to put them in. Um, where aren't there donation boxes? In the animals catalog? Uh, why would it be in here? Let's see. Let's see, I guess they are in here. ATMs. There you go, we'll put an ATM there for you guys. Enjoy, get your money out. Um, 
Shetland pony ride. I keep wanting to put this in. Let's put it in. Where's the entrance of this? Oh, there. Okay, so I'm gonna go like that. Ah, oh, but the rock's in the way. I don't want to have to move the rock. People seem to love the dolphins, I guess. I don't know. Let's do a little Shetland pony right here next to the uh, next to the rhinos. Um, if we put it that way. Oh, there you go. You can put it there. Ah, a little Shetland pony ride. That's good. Okay, now where's my donation box? That's what I was looking for. Where, where do you find them? Oh, it's in like benches catalog. Uh, category. Oh, and I always forget. Yeah, you can do the stupid eyedropper thing, can't you? Damn, I should remember that. Alrighty. So people sitting down eating. Uh, that's all good. So how are my dolphins going? How are you going in terms of training? Uh, pretty good, I guess. You're really good at jumping. What about you? Uh, you're terrible at everything. Well, let's... Let me just train you up quickly in this so we have... And then we'll set up a quick show before the end of this episode. Um, hurry up, please. There you go. Three, two. The music is great. Uh, yeah, and then we'll, we'll set up a quick show before the end of this episode. Um, I wonder if I add a second sort of ladder and a second trainer, if they can both train. Be, both be trained. There you go, reward the dolphin. Oh, you got a little two spheres. Yeah, let's do it again. Uh, which one was that? This one. Oh, we're gonna get the up and down action now. Getting complicated up in here. Okay. Oh, oh. Uh, oh, yeah, 99%. Good enough for me. Damn, we've got to concentrate when I do that stuff. Beautiful. Well done. Well done. Well done, Bottlenose Dolphin 2. There you go. Hoop jump. All right, so we're on the, I guess, last little bit. Let's do this one. This is going to be fast and dangerous. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, my God. It's always faster than I think it's going to be. 95%! Ah, oh, not too good. But it's good enough. <laughs> it is really good enough. Oh, this is great! I should just do a whole episode of this. This could be a whole different series. Let's do a training series. Let's train. And Zoo Tycoon 2. Oh yeah, reward. Oh, there you go. Look at that. Five. I don't know if it's actually five, because it looks like there's a little bit missing, but I think they all have that. Uh, so we unlock that trick. Well, let's, let's give him a few tricks. Let's give it a bar jump as well. It's so much quicker to train it myself than have the trainer do it, so... Maybe we should just do this. Three, two, one. These are all the same. It's just like, there's like, I guess they get change up once you get past the first level of all these tricks, but so far, like the, even the, like the jumping patterns are all being the same, so. So I'm going to get like RSI from doing the same mouse movement constantly. There you go, reward you. Um, <laughs> that'll be enough for now, though. We will, uh, we'll set up the, the show next episode. A uh, little, little teaser for next episode. But thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.